Hi ladies, I want to talk to you real quick today about the power of your words when it comes to talking to yourself. And there's so much uh, when we think about the power of our words and what the Bible says about that. But let's just talk first, like I said today, about the words that you are speaking to yourself. As a woman, uh, I think that I talk a lot to myself. I probably talk more to myself and in my head than I talk to anyone else because we're always having conversations, you know, uh, going on there. And so when we think about who we are, what are the words that we are saying to ourselves? Because who are you? You are God's design. And so when you speak negatively um, about yourself to yourself, you're devaluing and degrading God's design. And God does not make mistakes. He made you. The Bible says you are fearfully and wonderfully made. It says there in Psalm 139 that, you know, he's knit us together. So all, uh, you know, all the details he's, you know, intricately uh, chosen for us, about each of us. And so it's so important that when you are talking to yourself and about yourself, that you're not speaking speaking negatively. You're not speaking words that are discouraging and damaging to you. Um, because would you talk that way to another woman? Would you say that way, uh, you know, say that those things to your friend? Probably not. So why would you say them about yourself? In Proverbs 15, 4, it says a gentle tongue with its healing powers is a tree of life, but willful contrariness in it breaks down the spirit. And when it says spirit, there's a lowercase s, so it's talking about our human spirit. So when we speak words uh, that are healing words, uh, words that are positive, words that uh, show the value and remind us who we are in Christ, what the Bible says about us, that I can do all things, that even though I feel this way, I'm more than a conqueror, that I can, you know, uh, do whatever he's called me to do. I can do it with his help. My place is in him. His grace is sufficient for me. Uh, you know, even though I feel weak uh, in this certain area or whatever, when we say what God says about us, then those words bring healing. It's like a tree of life, it says. But willful contrariness breaks down the spirit. So when we speak the opposite of that, that's what we're doing. We're breaking down our spirits. And when we are breaking down our spirits, we're providing discouragement to ourselves. And we shouldn't do that. We need to have grace for ourselves and we need to speak the right way about ourselves. And that's not being prideful. Uh, that's doing what the Bible says and using your words uh, in the right way to speak life over yourself. Speak positively over God's great design, which is you.